Thanks, man. Welcome, sir. Please, sir, one picture. This bike. Huh? One picture. You want to take a picture? Yeah, of course. There you go. Where are you from? I am Indian. Oh, are you from India? Yes. Nice. Yes. Everybody likes a Pan America, man. Uh, we got Jerry over here, the coolest white guy I know on his Pan America. And we're about to head down South Jersey to get both of these bad little girls. Dirty, dirty, dirty. We're going to head off some um, some off-roading uh, roads. But yeah, we're going to be uh, heading down South Jersey. It's like an hour down or so. We're going to be meeting with Fly and Ride. Another YouTuber from out here in Jersey. Um, he has a few bikes. Nice little collection as well. So he'll walk us through his garage and show us what he has in there as well. He has a CVO. He has a BMW GS, I think. And then we're going to be meeting up with uh, Nadal. Um, he has another off-roading bike. So it's going to be an adventure day. Different adventure bikes. It'll be nice uh, to pull these bikes next to each other. Um, see what the huge difference is from uh, this to the GS to oh the Triumph that, that's what I think uh, Nadal has so nice little collection of adventure bikes nice dirty roads and uh some nice content for y'all man this is what I've been waiting to do for the longest time already since I picked up this bike from Bergen Harley Davidson which huge shout out to Bergen Harley for loaning me this bike for a full month man um it's, it's so exciting it's, it's, it's so cool but yeah the number one thing that i wanted to do obviously after picking up this bike was to take it off road and have some fun with it hey man nice pan america nice, yeah, nice pan america i don't like the green <laughs> you don't like the what i don't like the green at least the match i match i always match my bike power i'm a power ranger that's right i thought this jacket would be uh acceptable today <laughs> camel jacket with the green bike blending in doing some off-roading I'm out here feeling like a G.I. Joe, baby. You want to be on camera, right? Oh, this guy loves being on camera. <laughs> what up, guys? We made it down to FNR's crib right here. We got Jerry. We got Nadal. And the main man, FNR. What's going Fly on? Ride. Marvel kid. We're going to be linking up his uh, you, his channel down below. You guys can follow his channel. He has beautiful sleeve old right here. This thing is sick. What year is this again? 2020. 2020. Beautiful paint job. Thank you, man. Oh, you're, you're watching the channel, man? Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> look at that, man. It's up there. You want to you wanna turn it on real quick so everybody can yeah, hear it? Yeah, this thing sounds beautiful. You just got some engine work. You got a stage two on this thing. Yeah. And it get, sounds get lowered, uh, fabulous. Get lowered cycles. Get the whole uh, upgrade stage two. Full stage two on it. <laughs> That's 472. That sound is not an SNS. Zipper, sorry, zipper, sorry, zippers. <laughs> <laughs> but goes to show you how much I know about bikes. It's okay, man. It's all good. It's all good. It sounds great. It moves great. That's what matters. Yeah, it looks beautiful. Thank you, man. Talking about CVOs, this guy really has a pretty, pretty nice one. We're gonna stop by his house later. We're gonna test it out. Yes, <laughs> so we'll do that. So he, he got a he got a CVO from the 2021, the black with the red pinstripes, absolutely beautiful. And then he just recently picked up the new, um, is it a special? It's a 22 special yeah. with a 131. <laughs> that thing is a beast. This guy has like 10 bikes, I don't know. So we'll, we'll, we'll see everything in the garage. But today, like I said, we're all going to be on adventure bikes. Um, me and Jerry, obviously, on the Pan Americas. Um, FNR got the GS brand new as well. And then Nadal has a uh, Triumph. So get a lot of footage from there. Have some fun today. And let's think? get to some we, adventures. Should we do a Pan Am versus BMW today? What do you think? Let's do it. Let's do it, man. <laughs> let's do you it. You know what? A lot of people have a lot of questions about it. Like which yeah. one is actually faster on the low end? Which one's faster on the high end? Supposedly Jerry thinks he can take me. I don't know. <laughs> Jerry thinks he can take everybody. Anybody. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be a good test. So we'll, yeah, we'll, we'll put them by side, side by side. I haven't the exhaust on yet. Yeah. We what got is, some good roads. What is the exhaust going to give you? It's five, six hundred. <laughs> That's what that Let's get on to the adventures, baby. Who would have thought this channel two years ago being an adventure channel? What? <laughs> That's funny. All right, so most of these dirt roads that we're going to be hitting are they're actually in the local area around here, which is pretty nice. It's like a 10 minute ride he was telling me. So that's not bad. So we'll go there, we'll mess around, have some fun on those roads. Um, after that, we're gonna be heading down to Nadal's house, show you his bikes. 
um, have a few beers or so, smoke a cigar, and um, we might head down south even further down to another area where there's even like more off-roading roads. So just stay tuned, sit back, enjoy the video, and enjoy the adventure. These roads back here, they're all like off patch roads, a lot of gravel and dirt. So it's pretty cool. Testing out the traction control. Don't tell me. The wind took it. On this tree? Yeah, oh, holy shit. Yeah. And I was going backwards. Didn't even see it. I'm gonna bring my hammer to bring the ladder on the way back. Here, yeah, at least it's not that high. We got it done somehow. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta climb up. There we go. Come on, man. You're Cuban. You got this. <laughs> Good job! <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> oh man, one of the propellers broke. Well, two of them. Got extra ones. 
Yeah, at least we got it back. All right, well, that was a nice little adventure. <laughs> at least we got the drone back. Um, and the drone's okay. Just two of the propellers broke on it, but that's 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 the least of it. All right, so I switched off the uh, mode right here. So we're on off-road mode. So as we got all this gravel and dirt and everything. I just want to see bigger holes. I want to see mud. It rained a lot over here last night, so hopefully up ahead in the road we come across some stuff like that. <laughs> oh, this is fun. You can't do that on a bagger. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh yeah this is cool I could get used to this this type of riding all the time why not this is fun <laughs> Look at this, beautiful view right here. Awesome. Ah. At least this is lower, much more lower than the uh, Pan America. Oh, this thing got some spunk to it. <laughs> Oh, and the suspension is nice. It's real, real plush. Real plush. Take it to this corner. Whoa. The way it just leans in. Whoa. It kind of like dips in in the corners. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Uh, BMWs. Quick shifter if you want to test it. Okay. It's, it's fine. Get to the straightaway, test it out, you'll see how fun that is. BMW with their uh, boxer engines. Very, uh, <laughs> very weird feeling with these boxer engines. I remember when I got the, uh, the, uh, the R18. 
Whoa. Okay. 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 I, I I don't know. I I don't know which bike I like better now. <laughs> they all feel so great. Whoa! I felt like the front tire lift right there. <laughs> <laughs> this is torquey. This is real torquey. Whoa! <laughs> yeah, I just felt that front tire go up again. This bike is a lot of fun. The front wheel went up. <laughs> <laughs> it went up twice. And it's restricted because you don't have it on dynamic. Really? It's on road. This is, it's the medium setting. I, I if you want to go faster, put it on dynamic. Whoa! The, the wheel would have gone up completely. Like what do you think? Dude, it's yeah. torquey, dude. Yeah. A lot of power. Right, so give me your honest impressions. Like you've ridden both of them now. This one and the Pan Am. What do you think? I I, I don't know. It's very hard to tell. Like I will have to spend a lot of sea time on it. But this this is fun. This. Doesn't it feel balanced? It does. I mean, they, they, they all do. Yeah. That's the thing with these bikes, that they feel well balanced, well centered down to the ground. Or any other adventure bike. It's just, it's different. I feel like there's more power coming out of this bike um, as opposed to, oh, there he goes, <laughs> with the GS. Um, because this bike on sport mode, you, you can't beat it. It's really, really torquey. It's really fast. Amounts of power on here, man. And it, it feels more planted. All right. Back on the uh, dirt roads. Let's switch off. Um, let me see. Rain mode, road mode, sport mode. We're going to do that. Off-road mode. So see if we get a uh, kick up some dirt action here. <laughs> uh, these bikes are fun, man. These bikes are real fun. I gotta tell you, man. I uh, it's. <laughs> The amount of fun you have on these bikes doing stuff like this, you can't get that on anything else, man. There we go, that's what I'm talking about. I just wish it was all muddier here and holes everywhere and stuff to just go over. That would be pretty cool. But this is cool though, this is still fun. It just reminds me of that time when I was upstate last year and uh, me and the group of the guys, we got caught in a row like this and we were all on road glides and street bobs and low rider S's. And I mean those roads are horrible, but we did it on those bikes. But imagine doing you know roads like this on a bike like this where you know it's it's meant for this type of riding. It's capable, more than capable of you know doing stuff like this. The amount of traction you have and the bikes are so well balanced, they're made for this. Yeah, you have a tremendous amount of fun. Ah, the dirt's gone. All right, so a lot of these roads right here that Fly and Ride is showing us, it's a lot of roads like this. So it's like on and off dirt, pavement, dirt, pavement. So we're going to be going to a few other ones right now.
Harley Davidson, you have done a great thing right here, man. You have done a great thing. The amount of traction that these uh these tires have on all these like you know gravel roads like this and dirt roads are really good man like i'm not i haven't felt shaky or you know scared of doing or maneuvering the bike a certain way thinking that i'm gonna fall or slip away like it just feels very good well planted You know what I mainly like about this is that it's the fact that I don't need to worry about any potholes in the way or worry about my wheel getting messed up or anything like that because this is what this bike is meant for. That This, this is where like most of that fun comes into play is where you don't have to be worried about any of that. Most of the worst roads are going to be the fun roads and you don't need to worry about anything getting messed up because the bike is meant for that. <laughs> That was a lot of fun. That one was better. Huh? That's cool. That's nice. I wanted to see it, but I know you would enjoy it. Instead of another Harley, oh, we, we were pretty even. Something like that.